wish I could change it all. Karen. Garrosh. Theramore. Sometimes it feels like I did everything wrong. Do you think it will work, Goel? The druids and shaman uniting to restore the world tree? Would it actually heal this broken world? The Aspects believe it will, and they should know. They grew it in the first place. Welcome, son of Dordan. And to you, Agralon of the Frost Wolves. Lady Sarah. Greetings, friends. A sense of vast power has grown within you, young Thrall. You've achieved much since last we met. Master Stormrage, it's good to have you back in the waking world. Friends, we have gathered here today to heal this world that we've sacrificed so much to save. For the first time, the Earthen Ring and the Cenarian Circle will unite to restore this great tree, thereby healing the whole of Azeroth. Time is precious, sister. Let us see to our ritual. I'm sorry. Are we interrupting? The Twilight's Hammer! Not so fast, son of Durotan. You and your allies have certainly set us back, but the hour of twilight cannot be averted! The twilight prophet knows that you, and you alone, are our final obstacle. He sent me to remove you from the game. I do not fear death. Death? <laughs> Who said anything about death? Go ahead. No! You may be this world's greatest shaman thrall, but you are only mortal. This is my master's curse upon you, turning your great bond with the elements into your undoing. Even now, the elements are tearing you apart, and they shall feed upon your doubts and fears till the last spark of life on this wretched world has been snuffed out! You'll regret this, stranger! <laughs> Will I? Recognize your former pupil? Fandral, what have they done to you? Naive as always, I see. Your pet orc cannot save you now, Alfurion. And the flame of our vengeance draws near. Be ready! Fandral is corrupting fellow druids into something sinister. He may have other followers already. I must warn Moonglade. But what of Goel? He was the Earthen Ring's most powerful shaman, and the ceremony cannot continue without him. But we must be prepared to accept that he may be lost forever.
Bane would have died without your aid. I couldn't let that happen. Nor could I. I refuse to fail him like I failed his father. I wish I could change it all. Karen. Garrosh. Theramore. Sometimes it feels like I did everything wrong. We all have blood on our hands. And now Sylvanas will come. Thunder Bluff will burn. Just like Tildrassil. Once before, you and I stood side by side on the slopes of Mount Hyjal. That world tree did not fall, because the Horde and the Alliance worked together. Horde? Alliance? We've come to this crossroad again and again, Jaina. It always falls apart. What's different this time? We are. I should go. Anduin will want to know that Bane is safe. Tell your king he is not alone. Rightful war chief of the Horde! You are the orc who won my heart! Remember who you are! Agra, it is you. Be still, my love. Calm your mind. You became a slave to your duty, but being true to your heart is how you'll fulfill that duty. To your people, and to me. I would have it no other way. Agra, I... I can't hold on! I can't... Is this what Goel longed for most? Peace with his enemies. An end to the constant warring of his world? He... wished to lay down his weapon. And the burdens of leadership? Was I his deepest desire? A mate with which to share his life, his burdens and his joys? You have done the impossible, Shaman. You have stilled the vortex within him without losing yourself in turn. Your love for him must be very great. I need... The world needs him whole once again. But he's always placed the needs of others before his own. How long has he suppressed these feelings, these desires? He must embrace them and find balance, or this curse will never end. His aspect shifts once again. You are losing him. True war chief, now more than ever. Yes, but it was you that held the horde together during this madness. It was you that protected our honor. From this day forward, Vol'jin, if you lead, I will follow. I am not worthy.
but I will give my all for the Horde. I will speak to your war chief. I speak for the Horde. Very well. The Horde has committed heinous crimes, Vol'jin. But some among you fought against Garrosh's tyranny. For that, I am willing to end this bloodshed. But know this. If your Horde fails to uphold honor as Garrosh did, we will end you. Yes, mortals. Your thrall is here. He has fused with the stone of this place, heart and soul. His spirit is strong for a creature of mortal flesh. He fascinates me, and I am loath to give him up. Still, I can hear the cry of a distant heart echoing through the labyrinth between worlds. It's the cry of a lover's heart I hear, and great Therizane has not forgotten what it was to love. Your world shaman stands in the basalt groves below, but take heed, he has become one with these unending halls of stone. He may not wish to leave, regardless of whose heart beckons him home. You may seek him with my blessing. Thank you, Stone Mother. Quickly, friend. Goel should be just below. Your courage, your strength. You, you remind me of him. There! Look at him. Frozen in stone. Unmoving, unfeeling. That look on his face, the resolve, the stubbornness. He gets it when he digs his heels in. I have seen it before, in Nagrand, when he refused to lay down his mantle of war chief, and again during his training. I should have known. The Twilight Hammer knew we'd be here. Defend yourself! I heard your voice calling me back. Where are we? You're almost home, my love. Our time is so brief. You will change again, Goel. But I will find you. I will never give up on you. Agra! Agra! I can't hear! I can't... Love has become fire. I feared this. To find him again, we must enter Ragnaros's burning domain. Even now, I can feel the rage of this place pressing down on me. There! I see him! Wreathed in flame! I can feel waves of fury radiating from his core. Such rage! His anger alone could burn us to cinders! Gordon. If I must burn my way across the afterlife, I will find you in whatever hell you've hidden. I will have my revenge. Do you hear me? Raised as a slave, to kill for human amusement. Death was too good for Blackmoor. Anyone who would enslave another deserves worse than death. All are guilty. All must pay. King Varian, you wish to make war on my people? You shall have your war, human. You will see the fury of the Horde rage through your cities. You will see your throne split in two. This I swear. Kern was my brother! All I did. I did it for the Horde! You 
failed the horde. You must stop! Your anger is just, but it will only consume you! Fight it down or we are lost! Can you even hear me? Akra, it is you. I am alive. Goel, I thought I'd lost you. Akra, my heart. You never gave up on me. I owe you my life. Everything that I am. For I see now what I had become. So weighted down by doubt and anger. All my life, I had chosen to be a slave to fear. A thrall. Fandral sought to use that weakness against me. But what he and his Twilight Masters never understood is that the elements do not exist to rage and war. They exist to bring harmony within the world and within us. I have seen the truth and my chains have been broken. Now, I am all that I once was, and more. Well, you're certainly more talkative. But we must hurry back to the World Tree. The Dragon Aspects are waiting. And you, my love, have a world to save. Thank you, my friend. I can never repay your service, or your friendship. Meet us back at the World Tree. There's something I want you to witness. I've seen how truly fleeting our lives can be. And I, for one, will not waste another second of mine. What are you saying, Goel? What is in your heart? Agra. Though I was not born on Draenor, I have always tried to honor the traditions of our ancestors. I stand before you. Goel, son of Durotan, son of Garad. And if you would have me, I would be your life mate. For so long as I live, I will stand at your side, as you have stood at mine. I stand before you, Agralan, daughter of Rial, daughter of Sarak, and I will proudly be your mate, Goel. 
in this world or any other. So, this is home now. Home. And family. And where are they? Not far. This world... Well, it looks good. But it's wrong. Broken. Falling apart. Just like the Horde. Do you know? Do you know what she's done while you've been hiding? I left that life behind. I'm no one's savior. I will not lead the Horde. I didn't ask. But I hoped you would at least fight for it. Do we do now? We bring him home. I would not recognize Duratan's eyes. You were but a babe when I died. Tell me, who have you grown to be? I was once war chief of the Horde, the shaman of the Earthen Ring. That is who you were. Who are you now? I am uncertain. Much has happened in my life. I do not know where it will lead next. A lesson, then. Not from mother to child, but from one similar soul to another. Remember who you were, but take pride in who you are. I once thought death was the end, but now, as a warrior of Maldraxxus, 
I see that it was only the beginning. It brings me joy to see how far you have come. And I know you have much farther to go. Thank you, Mother. I will make you proud. Come. I wish to know more of your life. All of it. It seems some of the memories trouble you. Yes. I spoke of Garrosh, son of Gromash Hillscream. I'd hoped to spare him from the darkness his father knew. But instead, I fear I'm to blame for the ruin he unleashed. Fate sets a course before each of us. How are you to blame for the destiny he wrought? I took him from Nagrand. I made him war chief. But when he needed me most, I left him to falter. And in the end, it was my hand that struck him down. Your father used to say that a wolf decides whether to come when called or to turn on its master. There is no fault, only nature taking its course. Garage shows his path, my son. But I set him upon it. You offered him a choice. You did not choose for him. Mourn if you must, but his decisions are not your burden to bear. His path ended. Yours moves onward. Onward. Yes. There is much to be done. Thank you, Mother. choice is yours to make. Let honor guide you. Do not forget that Hellscream's eyes are always upon you. You can have anything you desire. <laughs>